All right, we've got some gamers on stream now. Here we go. Hmm, hold on, folks. Ladies and gentlemen, we're about to get the first game of Cheese League September 2022. And we have Catherine versus Caleb. They're doing some warm ups right now, so you know they're getting serious. Watch out. Yeah, watch out for these dastardly down smashes from Catherine. They are going to go off chops. Ah, uh, here's Grog. Ah. Uh, <laughs> is Grog Caleb? Is that the joke? Uh, I'm definitely all good, by the way, folks. I, d I do not need it all this time. I'm good, guys. Yep. Alright, thank you for the support so far, folks. We're about to get started. Alright, here we are. We have Catherine versus Caleb coming up. And they're doing fucking picking now. They're doing stage striking now. That is so cringe. If you ask me, that it took them this long and they didn't do it earlier. All right. Cyber Chase was airing on free to air TV. Nice. Solid word. I agree. Um, does anyone remember what ports these folks are in? I actually don't. Ready. All right, here you go. All right, game one. Okay, so we've gone to Battlefield for this first game, which is like, you know, uh, for Falcon, it's a great, like, neutral stage for him, IMO. Like, for Falcon, it doesn't really get much better than this other than Dreamland, but you don't really want to go Dreamland versus Peach. You know me, Lax. I am a, a known Falcon Peach player. Um, and in my professional opinion, I think this matchup is actually really good for Falcon. However, Catherine is a known Falcon Slayer. In fact, a known Fast Faller Slayer of, of all types, if, if we're being honest. Um, and Caleb just needs to find the fire within him to be able to actually connect those kind of knees. And he takes a stock, so that's nice. I'm happy for him. Uh, and that's not what you want to happen next. <laughs> uh, to put it bluntly. And we have the obligatory how can she slap from Lax. I appreciate that. Um, folks, how's the audio? Do I need to turn the microphones or the game up or down? Let me know. It's a bit hard to hear in the venue right now. Damn, a three star. This is fun. Yeah. yeah, keep it simple. All right, we got a question from XP2K. What are your thoughts on the Indomitable Human Spirit, Kaiser? Um, what I can tell you about the Indomitable Human Spirit um, is that 
I I do believe in it. However, it is taken away from us uh, because of the powers that be. Oh, and a clean first stock. Caleb showing that he actually does not have his own human spirit taken away from him. I'm really happy to see that. Did anyone see that tweet today that was like uh, hitting something? Oh, oh shit! Let's go, Caleb. Um, uh, did, yeah, did anyone see that tweet today that was about like hitting Stompney as Falcon uh, only works when you are possessed by the ghost of Stompney, which means that like you only get a, you only get like to have turns on whether the Stompney connects or not. I'll, I'll have to uh, I'll have to bring it up for the viewers at home, but it was quite humorous to me. All right, Caleb with a clean two sock lead at the mo at the moment. Very nice. The human spirit is like Yu-Gi-Oh when Yugi's grandpa got his soul taken away. Says Nya official. Uh, I mean, that's one form of human spirit, yes. Oh, yeah, uh, Catherine just kind of holding in on these up airs, not what you want. It's like going into stock knee, stomp knee debt, says Lax. Uh, not quite. There's no, like, rhyme or reason as to who gets possessed by the spirit of the stomp knee. I think it's just one of those things that it's like, if you, if you know, you know, and, you know, if you got it, flaunt it. Uh, if you're Falcon, you know. Every stomp we attempt incurs a debt to the knee. <laughs> That's that sounds like a net ability. <laughs> it's um chapter seven bankruptcy. But uh stomp knee instead. Uh Caleb looking much more comfortable in the second stage. Oh, I forgot to put uh, Catherine as the winner of the first game. Sorry, fam. Yeah, I, I like how Caleb's moving right now. It's looking nice. Oh, great. Great job. You got a neat little slide off and Catherine was quite slow to react. His up airs reek of grog energy, says Lex. Oh, oh, bye. Goodbye. <laughs> that was a grog down air. <laughs> I can't believe that fucking killed. That was bonkers. That was bizarro. It was very funny to me. All right, Catherine. Uh, what? How the fuck did that damage? Ooh! Weak back air almost uh, linked into something super nasty there. These two, uh, these two players have kind of been like, you know, going like switch rev uh, switch roles from the first game right now. Catherine, just trying to get some decided. Caleb, content to do some <laughs> uh, ledge cancel and stomps, but eventually falls to the demon of it. So the stomp knee ghost is kind of like the Satsui no Hodo, you know, like you don't wanna you don't wanna delve too deep lest you be corrupted by it. Yeah, the prize of game key control is going up is uh just as cringe as the price of uh, CRT is going up with supply decreasing. 93.99 AUD? That is fucking disgusting. Just buy a fob. <laughs> like, a fob will cost you a lot more than that, but like. Because you need parts from other game controllers anyway. Catherine, though. The indomitable human spirit is possessing her as we speak. I like a neutral right now. It's actually, it's it's like stuffy, you know. It's like she's checking um, Caleb's approaches at every opportunity, like that. So good. Oh, but that might be it. There it is. Caleb bringing it to one-one. Very nice. And in the next game, I wonder where we're going to go. Yeah, the Catherine counter pick. We're going to FOD. I love to see that. Yeah, I have been. Feel free to have a seat. There's a microphone on the ground. Yeah, mate. 
Yeah, man. Caleb and Catherine. Yeah, feel free to like put it nice and close oh. to your face. Oh. There we go. Yeah, Hopefully all games are best of five, yo. God bless ten person bracket, I think. It's nice. I That's like nice. it. I like it, to be honest. It's actually ten person bracket, so it's not pretty good. Don't have your butt. We got Ruben, we got yourself, you got myself, Catherine. Wait, Mary so who's in it? So we got Yeah, Yumi, do a do a roll call for it for the stream. You uh McLeod, Kai, Catherine, Nangs, uh Scraddles, Caleb, JJ, Lemons. Oh Lemons entered! Yeah, yes. Lemons entered. You know, yellow entered? Um, that's awesome. <laughs> yellow entered and Will. Will's and Will D. Will D. We have three. No, no Bailey today, though. We have three peaches and two puffs at the 10 person tournament. Look, I ain't got a sugar crater, but uh, Adelaide's kind of the uh, the hot spot for floaties. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> love it. Look, it's so good for me because I'm Falco, and I'm just like, sick, guys. I get to win neutral yeah, you forever. Have, you have the specific Falco that like, <laughs> likes floaties, and then Moscow as well. We have like all our floaties, we're either floaties or we're, like players who sort of get floaties. Yeah. Like even Nick's, Nick's got a secondary floaty, Ruben's half floaty, Moscat was a floaty. Yeah. You're the only pure blood. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would I don't think I could I honestly don't think I could play another character other than Falco. Just yeah. because it's like I don't know, it's um there's something about the character that's just like yep. endlessly challenging. Um but like Insanely rewarding, right? Because yeah. he's just like, I mean, he's obviously like, if you fuck up once, he's he probably gets hurt the most out of any character. But um, and like, he's kind of like you require a pension for yeah, perfection with the character, right? So you're always like, there's always room for like something that you could have done better. So it's like, yeah, I'm chill. That, that's why I was, I always describe Falcon in like a similar way, where I'm like, he's the character you pick if you want the infinite void. Yeah, yeah. If you if you stare into the void, yeah. If you if you want to stare into the void for the rest of your life, you can pick Cargo. There's like every every game, there's going to be five thousand things you could have done better, and there's like situations, like it's all ridiculous. But and then I'm like, I like the infinite void, but then again, I, like I the also void. don't like playing spacey dittos. So just oh yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't feel like Peach was just like the character I had to play for the time, but in the last Ooh. like year or so, I definitely feels like I can I can switch. That's cool. And Catherine going two and up. Caleb. Thinking a little bit. We're going stadium here? Uh, he going already stadium won here. on stadium. Oh, what? Game one on stadium? Uh, he won game two. Cath won on Battlefield. So I think we might see Battlefield again or Dreamland. Oh, okay. Big, yeah. big Dreamland pick. It's pretty normal. I don't know what I think of this. I guess it's just like, are you more comfortable in Yoshi's or are you more comfortable in Dreamland? Yeah. I see that. Falcon, Falcon feels like my worst matchup right now. You just like, there's a lot of stuff. Not a lot of people. Falcon? Play. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? I, that's something I never really thought about. Um, for you in particular, because like, I don't know. It, for some reason, like the traditional kind of knowledge of like, yeah, Falcon kind of obviously destroys Peach. Nah. Uh, for some reason, I was kind of like, yeah, it doesn't really apply to, to oh, you. Oh, no, I don't think Falcon destroys Peach. I just think, like, Falcon has, like, a lot of upkeep. <laughs> no one plays Falcon. Oh, uh, <laughs> all right. I, li I like the Falcon matchup a lot, but, like, when, when when you... I think I just, like, went to play... Oh, yo, Spot's Falcon yesterday, where I'm just, like, missing oh, every... Oh, ed every right. he's like, playing again. Edgar. Yeah, Spot's playing again. Spot is actually active again. It's kind of scary. Yeah. He's, uh... It's good. I think the, he, he felt... The, the first few weeks definitely felt like he was dipping his toes in and I wasn't sure. And yeah. now he feel, it feels like he's, he's diving in a bit more, which is really good to see. That's awesome. He's, he's, he's getting a bit better fast, so we'll see. I still think, I still think he's behind at least um, Josh Sock and Nick right now. I'll be interested to see where he is in a month or so. Yeah, he, he looks rusty, right? Like, you can tell. But he's uh, de-rusting pretty fast. Mm. Like, I played a, yeah, the session I had yesterday felt, it felt better than the, significantly better than the session I had a week ago. Yeah, so I, and I'm not here to, like, speculate about what he was doing in the time away from Melee or anything, but, like, Spud doesn't seem like someone who's, like, you know, um, I, 
He doesn't... I find this funny, right? Just correct me if I'm wrong, but he doesn't seem like he has a very addictive personality. Like where he gets... Yeah, I think... Which I is interesting, that. right? Yeah, kind of. Right, yeah, like, yeah. I, it, it doesn't really seem like he kind of, like... He has, like, a vice forever or anything like that. It's just kind of like... Yeah, he like has, like, interest for a while, and then, like, you know... I can totally see that, actually. Yeah. yeah. It actually doesn't look like that. I know he's a JRPG fiend. Yeah. I wonder if he got into... Yeah, I think he's right. about progression, right? Yeah. Not, like... <laughs> I played Ultimate for a while, but then couldn't play Netplay. Yeah. I think he was the best in WA for a bit, which is funny. In Ultimate, before... before yeah, just for a little while. Yeah. It was... Yeah. That was, oh my god, this... That was, like, the last fandom he went to. Yep. Yeah, this is kind of blown out a bit. This is... I don't know, this is... Three grabs away. It's not three grabs away. It could be three grabs away with Caitlyn Catherine's the Let's find out. All right, no, it wasn't. I, the thing I've told Caleb for, like, the last five years was, like, your pe the single biggest thing he could change to make his Peach matchup better is be able to react to DI out and DI in. Right. Being reacted, like, because he just reads. Like, you, yeah, he does like, like, you saw it earlier where he just, like, grabbed, which is the ration for DI out, whereas you have to nair DI in. And I'm like, 90, like 90% 90 of your... Because you get counter hit if you guess oh, and you guess wrong. Oh, that's it. That's no. it. That's it. That's 3-1. Catherine would be seed 3, which means she's playing you. Okay. So if you want to do that, you can do that. No, um, I've I'm got waiting. just... Oh, no, you have uh, that just, first. Just, and then um, do you, who's got, who's got a game? We have myself and Will, winner of Will. 